Hola, amigos. <laughs> it has been quite some time since we made a video. So long. And there's numerous reasons for it, and we will get to that later. But we made a video during our second week of classes here, and it was 16 minutes long, so YouTube or Facebook would not let me upload it. So we have a lot to talk about because it's like a month later, so we're going to have to make smaller videos. Actually, I'm so awkward in that. <laughs> <laughs> we I get in the... I can't. Okay, <laughs> okay so our, the topic of this video is going to be... <laughs> it's going to be public transportation. How do we feel about public transportation? We got lost. We weren't lost. We just were on the wrong train, going the wrong direction. And we're oh my god, we were on the train for two, two hours. hours. <laughs> First off, it's really hard to get anywhere here because... Our, our Taipei is huge, and we live in Guangdu, and so Guangdu, and then everything ghetto. big is, like, over here. So it takes, like, 30, minimum of 30 minutes to get to, like, the big city of Taipei. Um, we have to take a bus to get to the train, and then you have to get on the train, and then taxi, if you're going to take a taxi, you have to have everything written in Chinese, because mm -hmm. they don't speak English, and... Hmm. So it's just a hassle to go do anything, like go grocery shopping or... And you have to carry your groceries You have to back. carry stuff back. It's just a big pain in the ass. The fridge, your food gets thrown away if you can't read Chinese. Oh, yeah. The sign that they're cleaning out the fridge. We've had some, we had a rough month. We will, we will call October the rough it month. Rough. But... So, funny stories that happen on the train. In our first video, we talked about the staring on the train. Well, I'm just kind of over it now, and I just kind of stare right back, or I just don't give a shit. But this one time, when we were on the train going the wrong direction for about an hour, there is it was on a holiday, so the train, it was like their Independence Day, so there was a shit ton of people on the train, and there So many kids. So many kids, because they all didn't have school. school. So, there was this one baby... <laughs> He was really. First, it was the one who looked like Elvis. Oh, he was. His this hair. kid looked like Elvis. He was so cute. He was perfect. Asian babies are actually really cute. Mm -hmm. Um, but the funny thing is, they have at, unlike the older people that stare at us, the babies have actually never seen probably someone that looks like us. So it's actually funny when they spot us because their facial expressions. There's this one, he was you so do it. chubby, you can he do was it. so cute. Obviously, I was looking at him, that's what I do on the train, I look at the babies. Um, but he was just, he was looking around and looking around, and then he turned his head and spotted Ashley, and as soon as he saw Ashley, <laughs> he was just like, he looked and he was like... That was the face. And he was frozen he for was like, like five minutes, and I was like... He was <laughs> and I was like, Ashley, wave at him, like, he was like, wait, and she was like... And he was like... <laughs> it was so funny, and he, he didn't blink. It was like he, he was, was literally his face was like, "What the fuck is it was that?" So it was funny. Oh my god! Um, and then since we're on the train so much here, Eve and I have invented this amazing game. <laughs> we look at all the people around us and we decide what song like fits their life in that moment, and it is so much fun. Yeah, there was this couple that was, like, on top of each other, like, making out, and we decided that their song is, they have a, we come I mean, up, there was a variety, there was a variety, Take You, Take You Down, Take, you take, down. take you down by Chris Brown was one, um, Let's Get It On, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> then there was this row of women, <laughs> so mad about their lives, literally, they were, they were directly across from us, all older women, they were just, like, looked miserable, and I was like, oh, their song should be... Tonight, we are, <laughs> and then your song, the Spice Girls. Oh, I don't even know the words, I can't even that well. Just do, what was the one line? You're like, no, 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 this is something better, and it was, Spice Up Your Life. <laughs> spice Up Your Life. <laughs> um, so we played that, and that's really entertaining, because then we started doing songs that don't fit them, and that's actually yeah. funnier. Um, but yeah, we hate public transportation. Where's my car? Miss my do have a song for Liz. Oh, oh, yeah. I didn't know if I should bring it up. No, what was have, it? Um, wasn't it? Yep. Mm -hmm. So we came up with a song. Then we started coming up for people at Goucher, like their songs, and we did Liz Ahern. And Eve came up with this brilliant tune. Sing it. Oh, I can't sing that. Yeah, video. 
I was singing it for like Wait, an hour. Let's see if I, ha- I probably have it on my... We do. We also have one for Amanda, too. But we have one for Amanda, too. Exactly. That is the most perfect. All right, here, here we go. This is, this is Liz Ahern's song. It's so hard. <laughs> it is her. It's so hurt because her ballet class is at 8.30 in the morning. The morning and so are you guys tired? What's wrong with you guys? Like, are you tired? It's like, hop out of bed. Guys. I just I eat my oatmeal in the, bref- in, the, in the breakfast. <laughs> she just talks about how she eats her oatmeal in the morning and she's full for like hours and we're just like fantastic. So, yeah. And then we had one for Amanda, but I don't... It without me. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get to that later. But yeah, so this is our video on public transportation. We hate it. Okay. <laughs>